we wanted to get the pace really fast early. And I know they made some shots, but um, that's okay. We wanted to get up and down and, and we wanted to get into their bench because their bench was really inexperienced. And the guys that come off the bench for them, I think, are three freshmen and a, and a junior college kid. So we wanted to get into their bench and, and um, I thought we followed a game plan pretty well. We just didn't, when it came down to it on the, on the <clears throat> defensive end, just one-on-one -on -one guarding the ball, keeping guys in front of us, we, especially the last 10 minutes, we kind of uh, faltered. But that, I, I understand that they're human and they, they were looking at the score once we got up 22 or whatever it was and, and uh, started to relax a little bit. We're very comfortable here. I mean, we shot 68.8% 68 .68 from three. So uh, I mean that's that's just what it's that's what it's going to be like when we get to play at home. But uh, I think we're just going to we're going to have to reevaluate ourselves on the defensive end and uh, and not give up 53 percent. It was nice to see some shots go in. You know, once I hit a couple, I feel like my teammates, it's like they drop everything and whatever they whatever they want to do to get me open, they do. Um, they do a great job, man. I, I can't have can't ask for more unselfish guys to play with. They do, they're pretty awesome. Um, this is the time of year where. Uh, it's nice to have experienced team because I think you can you can show video and they can get it by watching video um, and, and it's it's getting to that time of the year where where it's the sliding scale you know how much do you do on a court to try to get the reps to get it ingrained in their head with what they need to do to be successful versus can you show them on the video have them comprehend and understand it and then save their legs so they can do it at a high level. And that's, you know, with a young team, you can't do that. You can't do that. You got to go out there and grind it. And, and, but with these guys, um, hopefully we can do a little bit more video and, and learning from what we need to do to be better from the neck up. For us, it's going to be coming in tomorrow and really, and, and, and it being um, from the neck up and being able to just understand that we need to stop their offensive ability and so um, if we're able to do that I think um, teams aren't going to be able to play with us because we have such depth that um, we can get guys in and out. Let's talk about that crowd yeah uh, awesome the, crowd the the yeah that was awesome you know they gave us such a spark and when we play fast like that and get dunks and hit threes it just gets loud in there um, that's fun that's a fun atmosphere doesn't do anything but help us um, honestly I didn't even feel like you know, as the game goes on, you kind of have a feel of how you're playing, how the team's right. playing. And there was probably three or four minutes in the second half, and I was like, we're not playing very well. I looked up, and we were up 12. I was like, okay, I mean, I'll take that. From day one, I've always felt like our team is the team that, that someone has to come and beat us. Uh, off and on, on and off the court, our coaching staff, I feel like we all have confidence in each other. We, we all understand that we're not playing necessarily just for this program, but for each other. We've been given a gift. We've been given a gift of being able to play a lot of games at home. Um, and, but we're doing what we should do, which is take advantage of it and, and knock those out. Um, I'm real happy with the, with the win at Montana. I was really happy with the way they bounced back. I thought they showed a lot of maturity. Uh, and I thought they handled um, their coach getting on them pretty hard and then bouncing back and, and playing like guys that that have some some pretty high goals you know I thought Tate and and Derek and, and even Connor you know he only played 13 minutes but he had seven rebounds in 13 minutes I thought all three of them did what seniors are supposed to do in a stage like that and that's 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 the one thing that's keeping me pretty positive right now is that is is that when they when they get called to the called to the fire so to speak they, they've shown up this year